The May 24th, 2016 meeting of the Transportation Committee will now come to order. Will the clerk please call the roll? Mrs. Brown? Here. Chairman Howland? Here. Mr. Lightfoot? Here. Mr. Michike? Here. Mr. Rocco? Here. Mr. Shepard is excused. Mr. Zale? Is there anyone present who is, oh, I'm sorry, is there anyone signed up for the public forum? There is not. Is there anyone present who is not signed up to speak who would like to address the committee at this time? Seeing no one, we'll move on to the approval of minutes. The next item on the agenda is approval of the minutes. You have the April 26, 2016 minutes of the Transportation Committee before you. They will stand approved unless the clerk is notified of any changes by the end of the day. Today we have a presentation. Rochelle Bell, Senior Environmental Planner of the Planning and Development Department will now give a brief overview of the 2017-2022 Capital Improvement Program as it pertains to the Transportation Committee. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. You should all have received a copy of the 2017-2022 um, CIP. It's been reviewed and approved by the Monroe County Planning Board, and they conducted a public information meeting as part of their review. I'd like to remind the legislature that there are no funding approvals associated with taking action on this referral. This is a plan. Um, in June, you'll set a public hearing for July, and then hopefully you'll vote to approve the plan. There are two sections of the CIP that are pertinent to this committee. Highway and Bridges begins on page 51 of your CIP, and transportation, uh, traffic engineering is on page 64. There are just a few things to note um, in the Highway and Bridges section. Um, for the first time this year, we moved equipment and vehicle that line from fleet. In past years, if you were here, you would have noticed it was under fleet. This year, it's been moved to the um, highway and bridges line, and we separated out heavy and <coughs> light vehicles. Um, also, the highway rehabilitation program that was in the last year's CIP has been broken out into seven separate projects for the CIP. And uh, finally, the new project, so there's one new project for um, highway and bridges that is for Miles Square Road, a bridge over Rondequoit Creek, and the first year of funding for that project is in 2022. I'll be happy to take questions when you get to this item on your agenda. Thank you. Thank you. The next item on the agenda is new business. <laughs> Madam Clerk. Referral 16-0165. Moved by Legislator uh, Mitchell K, seconded by Legislator Zale. Is there any discussion? There being none, all those in favor, signify by saying aye. Opposed, the item passes. Referral 16-0168. Moved by Legislator Zale, seconded by Legislator Brown. Is there any discussion? There being none, all those in favor? Signify by saying aye. aye. Opposed? The item passes. Yeah, that's it, right? Yep. Are there any other matters that come before this committee? There being none, the May 24th, 2016 meeting of the Transportation Committee stands adjourned. The next meeting of the Transportation Committee is scheduled for June 28th, 2016 at 5.15 p.m.